Hey, um, I'm gonna try and shoot this video again. Um, I just did an amazing 25 minute video for y'all. Um, and it was too long. And now I'm a little bummed. Because YouTube, I don't think I'm gonna be able to find it or upload it for y'all. But when John gets home, he's gonna try. So we'll see, okay? I have notes in several different locations so I'm gonna sort of be looking around a little bit okay we're gonna talk about recruiting all right um, let me get my notes up here on my phone um, first let's talk about um, my recruiting folder okay when I first joined Cincy I read on the forums and several different places about people having recruit folders and I didn't know what that meant I, I sort of went looking for a list of things and couldn't find it um, this is one that I've adapted from Jessica's recruit folder um, it's my take on that it's just simple okay um, this is just the cheap 77 cent folders you get at Walmart or wherever um, the three prong kind that you used in elementary school I have my label up here because we label everything, right? If it leaves our hands, then we label it. And it's Cincy Green. And inside I have my business card and the little slit spot for a card, right? And a join brochure. Okay. And I also printed off and glued in here just to the folder the three brands that folks can sell okay this is a good time to mention if you only sell Scentsy fragrance you can still recruit for Velada and Grace Adele okay you don't have to just recruit for Scentsy fragrance alright so that shows them their options next over here in the three prongs I have how folks can get their starter kit for free. Um, again, this is adapted from Jessica's note that she created. Um, basically, this just explains how people how people can get it for free. Obviously, um, you get orders in your pocket before you join. That's it. Okay. So then once you have those orders in your pocket and you join Scentsy, let's say, Scentsy Fragrance, um, you can turn around and reimburse yourself for your starter kit with the commission that you make from your first party or those first orders that you get, okay? Um, this is on the Google Docs account that I share with y'all, all right? So you can find that there and, and read it. I'm not going to read it to you. Um, this is the shooting star flyer and super important to put in here so they know from the get-go this is their first goal that they need to shoot for okay this is also on the Google Doc and then I include my Cincy story it says Cincy story you see um, it talks about just a little about me then how I got started with Scentsy Fragrance, um, where I have gotten to in the short time that I've been with Scentsy, and where I want to go. I think it's important to share your goals with your recruits to encourage them for their own goals, okay? Um, and then it just says something about contact me if you have any questions about anything in this folder, yada yada, okay? Um, you could put a catalog in your recruit folder. Um, I think Jess said that she puts a scent circle in her recruit folder just as a thank you. I take these to parties and to vendor shows. Um, if you wanted to, you could put it in your purse with you. So if you start chatting up somebody at the grocery store, you have this to hand them and you don't have to say oh let me get your email address and when I get home with my two toddlers and all my groceries and I put my children in the bath 
and before I go to bed, I'll email you some information about joining Cincy. Because I won't remember. But this I have in my hands already, and I can just give it to you. Then I just have to follow up. It's that easy, okay? Um, so this is a good thing to have. Um, what else do I have? Another easy thing is this um, This is from Cincy, this flyer. I just printed it. Um, I got this frame at the dollar store. It's actually a frame for a certificate because this paper is 8.5 by 11, so it wouldn't fit in an 8 by 10 and be as pretty. It wouldn't fit in an 8 by 10 frame. So I just got one from the dollar store for a certificate. And John, he's so nifty, attached this little doodad on the back. He made out of cardboard, so it'll stand. And I put this at my parties and at vendor shows. It's just a little, hey, you can buy Scentsy, but you can also join Scentsy. Okay? Um, just a reminder to folks. So that's two things way easy for you to do to get recruits, okay, to get the word out about recruiting. Um, I'm referring to my notes. One second, please. And I only have 15 minutes, by the way. Thank you, YouTube. Um, yada, yada. Okay, ways to recruit. This is something that all of y'all have asked me. Facebook. We all use Facebook. Why don't you post... Um, Today we're getting paid a day early. Hey, I got paid a day early and my commission, I made over $200 commission on last month's sales with Cincy, working in my PJs at home. Or um, I am able to stay at home with my two toddlers and work in my PJs while they sit on the floor and color or um, extra holiday cash. If people join now, they will still get commission before Christmas. They would get paid December 10th, and so that's still money they could use on Christmas presents or, or whatever they want to. Um, so post those statuses, okay? Um, talk to your host about joining. That's a no-brainer. Two of y'all... Two of my recruits were um, basket party hosts, long distance basket party hosts. Because you had orders in your pocket before you joined, it's easy to win you over and say, oh, hey, why don't you go ahead and join Cincy? You already have these orders. Instead of putting them under my name, we'll put them under your name after you join. So then they're even that much closer to shooting star and um, that much closer to promoting to certified faster. I mean, it's a no-brainer, right? Um, my first video was so much better. <laughs> I hope we can find it. Um, sell for today, recruit for tomorrow is a, uh, a saying I heard, I think, with one of Aspen's webinars she did. My time's counting down. Um, you sell Cincy for today, but you recruit for tomorrow because you get commission off of your recruits. So I, I love that motto. Um, along those same lines, I want to remind y'all, it's a good habit to go ahead and get into, even if you don't have a recruit yet, to start working towards a $500 PRV a month. Because when you get a recruit, you're going to need that 500 a month PRV to make commission off of them. That's the the minimum PRV for you as uh, someone with a recruit to get commission off of them. So get in that habit now so as you add recruits, you have that customer base and you're in the habit. Okay? Um, it is super important to follow up with your recruits, okay? Um, let's say 
um, Mary Beth tells you, you you give Mary Beth a recruit folder, okay, a potential recruit folder, and Mary Beth says, well, I, I am really interested in joining Cincy. Um, I got a lot going on right now, but um, maybe when my husband gets paid in two weeks, then I can join. So that what I do is I say, okay, Mary Beth, well, in two weeks, I'll touch base with you if that's okay with you. Oh, sure, sure, that's, that's okay, Steph, you can touch base with me. Okay, so then I go on my iPhone, because I won't remember, and I add an alarm, an event, and, and set an alarm for that day in two weeks, whatever that day is, a reminder to call Mary Beth. Hey, Mary Beth, I want to call and make sure or see if you had any questions about joining Cincy, if you were still thinking about that, you got to follow up. Just like with our customers, you got to follow up with your potential recruits. Okay? Um, another good thing to do is um, in August and February, those are our transition months from spring, summer, fall, winter, and vice versa. So what you want to do is, they, and they always run some sort of special for joining during August and February, typically. So you want to keep a running list of all of those potential recruits that you've spoken with in the last, what, six months? And give them a call, text them, email them, whatever you prefer. Phone calls are best. And tell them, hey, Mary Beth, I just wanted to touch base with you. I know we hadn't talked in a little bit, but... I want to let you know that Cincy is offering testers for fall, winter, and spring, summer for the same $99 join-in price. It's a really good deal. Do you have any questions about join-in? This will be a great time. You don't have to do it with lots of pressure, but you want to keep it her informed of, of that this is a great time to join, right? Um... What else? Let me refer to my other notes. I'm really close to my, my time limit. YouTube. Um, okay, this is something important. <coughs> Excuse me. It's out of Sensi compliance to advertise that you'll give something to somebody if they join your team, okay? For instance, hey, Mary Beth, it's Steph. Um, if you join my team, I will give you a full set of mini testers because I really, really want you on my team, Mary Beth. So if you come on over and join, I'll give you a set of mini testers. You can't do that. What you can do is, as soon as Mary Beth comes over and joins, Oh, Mary Beth, I'm so excited and so glad you joined my team. Here is a set of mini testers as a thank you, and this will help you get started with basket parties. Okay? You see the difference? You can't do that. Um, I feel like this time I'm Russian, and it's not as good. things you want to share with your potential recruits, okay? Um, you want to go ahead and explain to them when you give them your recruit folder, that might be a good time. Or um, since we have all of these documents online, you could email it to them. If, if you don't want to mail it to them, if they're long distance. Um, I have a young lady in Alabama that I'm talking to and a young lady in Georgia. So I've sent them all this through email instead of an actual physical folder. Excuse me. So what you want to do is explain to them, as soon as you join, you start out as an essential consultant, and you are making 20% commission. As soon as you sell 1,000 lifetime PRV, and you'll have to explain to them what that is, then you'll move up to 25% commission and you'll become certified, all right? Um, that's a huge selling point. 
I'm really close to my time limit. Ah! Um, what else do we want to? Obviously, you tell them about the starter kit that's $99, all the cool things that they get in there. Um, there's no monthly quota. <coughs> Excuse me. That's a huge selling point for folks, too. I was looking at Cincy and another direct sale company when I joined Cincy. Because the other one required a really high quota every month or every other month, um, I didn't go with them. And I like Cincy better. Anyway, um, so let me explain this. We have to sell a dollar every six months to stay a Cincy consultant, okay? To stay active, we have to sell $150 in one month of three months, okay? So let's take May, June, July. In May, you only sell $50. And in June, you sell another $50. And in July, you sell 100 You won't be active. Okay, you have to sell $150 comprehensively, comprehensively, yeah, comprehensively, I guess, in May, in June, or July, okay? Does that make sense? Um, if they, if you have a customer who is your number one customer, and every two months she buys $150 worth of product for herself, you need to talk to her about joining. Even if she chooses not to ever sell to anybody but herself, she can make commission off of her own products that she's buying for her house or for gifts and also use her host rewards. That's, that's silly. That's a no-brainer. Why, why would you not? Um, I know. What did I do before an iPhone? I promised my first video was amazing. And I was witty. And there were jokes. Maybe not jokes. There weren't jokes. No. Uh, yep. That's it. I hope, I hope that was helpful. Um, I hope even more that I can retrieve the first video, even though it was really long. Maybe I can split it into two parts and let y'all watch that. Okay? Um, as always, let me know if you have any questions. Okay? Bye.